All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shah, by Hashem Rakak with Dash. I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And it's a sincere Shalom to the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay? Um, title of this video is Don't Let Your Sins weigh you down okay and that's you know based off of the scriptures okay and um you know it's wisdom also okay when you go through um life in this truth okay we're bound to uh go through you know things okay that you know we're we're, we're bound to, to to get off track okay but the, the good thing is that, you know, we have this truth, so we're able to, to, to get back on track, okay? Now, I'm going to go ahead and jump uh, to the scripture. It's uh, the book of uh, Second Ezra, um, chapter 16, verse uh, 75. It says, Be ye not afraid. Neither doubt for God or Yahweh is your God. And the God of them who keep my commandments and precepts. Save the Lord God, Yahweh. It says, Let not your sins weigh you down. Okay. So in this truth, okay, we're gonna work. If, if you are in this truth and you keeping the law, statutes, and commandments, okay, to the best of your ability, okay, you're going to go walk, okay? And sometimes it's a, uh, 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 a, a, like, like you know that you're going off type of thing, or, or you feel like you're going off, okay? And, um, the best thing to do. Okay, is, you know, walking on eggshells is, you know, making sure that we're not doing those things that are, you know, easily an offense onto Yahweh Sim Yahweh You know? So it says, let not your sins weigh you down. So the thing is, we're, we're going to um, sin in this truth. Okay? We all, we all fall short, man. Okay? One way or another. Okay, it says, and let not your iniquities lift up, lift up themselves. Okay, and in this truth, this is not a a, a matter of uh, being over righteous, man. Okay, it say, be not over righteous and be not over wicked. Okay, because because we're gonna go off. Okay, and um, part of um, this truth. You know, is getting um, counsel, okay? There, there were many times where, you know, I personally have have been in certain situations where um, I had to go seek counsel to check and see whether or not I was wrong, okay? And even, even, you know, going, you know, talk, asking the apostles, asking elders, asking brothers about certain situations. You know, and then to hear their response, you'd be like, God, dang, I ain't expect that, you know, but the whole time, you know, you don't want to go off because you, we, we, we're, we're in fear and, 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 and want to actually make it, you know, but we're still in this flesh one way or another. Okay. We're, we're going to, we're going to do wrong one way or another. Okay. That's that's one of the reasons why we need a savior, okay? Because this 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 sin is a serious ordeal, man. Okay, and ain't nobody gonna be perfect, man, in, until Yahweh Sa comes back and save his people, man. Okay, ain't nobody gonna be perfect. You, you know, it don't matter. You know what what you may be doing, okay? Uh. What, what, like, I'm gonna use this example, okay, and I'm gonna get the scripture, okay. But, um, you, you could go through a situation 
personally, right? Whereas though it may seem small to the next brother. Okay, and the next brother would be looking at your situation and being like, hey man, you tripping over that? Or you going through that, you know? That's some small thing. But the whole time, that's something really big to you. Okay? But then the whole time, the, the situation could flip. And that brother could be going through something. And you look at him and be like, yo, you, you tripping over that? You know? So different brothers have different cups that they have to drink on this path to your, to towards your house by some y'all shot. Okay? On this path towards this 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 kingdom of, you know, of heaven. Okay? Um... Wisdom of Solomon, uh, chapter 1, verse uh, 12. It says, Seek not death in the error of your life, and pour not upon yourselves destruction with the works of your, your hands. Okay? So, so it's, it's, it's kind of like we're, we're at a major advantage because we're in this truth, but we're also at a disadvantage because, you know, we're more susceptible, okay, to you know, the demons, okay, and the temptation, okay, than the rest of the world, okay, because a, a person in, in the world, okay, they may go through some temptation, okay, and they just go with it because they actually, they, they don't give a fuck, you know, they, they don't fear the Lord, but us, okay, being as though that we're in this, this knowledge, we're expected to know better, okay, and then sometimes you end up getting in a situation where you 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 think that you're supposed to know better, but then you end up doing some some stupid stuff, okay, some 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 foolishness, okay, and you end up uh, sinning, okay. But that's where that's where you know forgiveness comes into play because the Lord is a merciful power, man. Okay, so once again it says, seek not death in the era of your life, okay. So if you do something wrong. Don't seek your life or, or, or make it seem like you're a, you're a part of the two-thirds, okay, or, or that the Lord going to destroy you or kill you. You don't got to look at it like, like that, man. Don't let your sins weigh you down. Now, like I said, you know, we all go off. And I'm pretty sure that there's people in this truth who, who probably went back to, you know, smoking a blunt or something like that. You know, me personally, I'm not into that smoking weed, but I'm pretty sure it's some... Somebody that probably went back to smoking a blunt. Now, you, you cut that out, man. Don't do that no more. You know, we don't condone in that. You know? But but the thing is, if you, you know that you're doing something wrong, okay? Don't seek death in the era of your life because we can keep on pushing, man. It says, uh, for for God made not death. Yeah, how about some y'all side made not death? Neither hath he pleasure in the destruction of the living. Okay? And guess what? If you in this truth, then you're of the living, man. Okay? You're of the you're of the saints, man. Okay? The, the if the Lord straight up put you, you know, put you to death, then you 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 a straight up wicked ass nigga. And you deserve that shit. Okay? And what like that scripture said, let let not your um iniquities uh lift themselves up. You got a lot of people out here who 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 just don't even care, you know. A homosexual go back to being relapsing and being a fucking homosexual, you know. You got that that somebody trying to say that you know, but he ain't he ain't using the right name, okay. But this guy, you know, claimed to be a homo, you know, he was a homosexual before, and then he went back to being a homosexual again, you know. You don't you don't do that in this truth, okay. But the like like I said. The, the Lord doesn't have pleasure in the destruction of the living. Okay? So so if you're going through through some type of temptation, okay, and, and you 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 falling, okay, as the, the, the scriptures say, uh Proverbs 14 and 16, for a just man falls seven times and rises up again, right? But the wicked shall fall into mischief. Okay, and, and 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 you got you know if we're talking about you know the heavenly Father, okay, which is He's our Father, okay. You gotta look at it like you don't want to you don't want to make your earthly Father mad. How much more the heavenly Father, okay? Which He just uses that as an example, you know, of how He is, okay. 
So your your earthly father ain't gonna want to want to uh you know beat your ass and stuff like that you know cause cause you um you know or kill you I should say cause you um uh messed up one time you know it probably do in this world but when it comes down to the heavenly father when you go to the to the law okay it says a rebellious child okay you know that the the Lord said hey don't do this and then you still continually to do that. Then that's when you know that that the Lord has it out for you, man. Okay, and you don't need to be you don't, you ain't in this truth if you if you are, are, are falling into mischief and you just being a, 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 a you know just a demon, okay. But but being in this truth, we we bound to go off, okay. As the scripture said, just man falls seven times but rises up again, okay. So we're gonna fall, okay. But 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 it's not about how how you fall and and wanting to not you know uh fall out and and and, and uh, give up okay you may be in a situation where you may not be able to put up three videos a week do that mean that you continue to to, to to not do three videos a week no you continue to push man okay you push until the end don't 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 give up okay don't don't seek that for I, I ain't do my three videos so I must be a nigga. I must be falling out. No, man, that ain't how, how we supposed to be thinking in this truth. Okay? The Lord is the Lord is full, full of mercy. Okay? It says, For he created all things that they might have their being, and the generations of the world were healthful. And there was no poison of destruction in them, nor the kingdom of death upon the earth, for righteousness is immortal. But ungodly men with their works and words called it to them. For when they thought to have it their friend, they consumed to naught and made a covenant with it because they are worthy to take part of it or part with it. Okay, so when, when people are getting destroyed, okay, that's because they these motherfuckers are, 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 are worthy of being destroyed. Okay? But if you if you in this knowledge... Okay, and you 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 go off and you 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 fall. Okay, you don't you don't go through life and you just be like, man, the Lord gonna kill me, man. The Lord gonna take me out. No, nah, man, the Lord gonna have mercy on you if you if you keep on pushing, man. Okay, keep on doing this work. Don't just give up. You know, the moment that you go off, cause all of us go off, man. Like I said, like it's it's times where I had to go to to, to apostles and elders and brothers. And ask them about certain things, man. Okay? Well, I'm thinking like, yo, I'm going all the way off. But then they say, nah, man, you, you know, you 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 going, you doing right. But then there's other brothers who, who will say, you know, nah, that's that ain't right. You know that you, you, you ain't supposed to do that. You know, that's why you gotta that's why you gotta, you know, work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Okay? And and keep on pushing, don't give up, man. Okay, no matter what what anybody uh say to you, man. Okay. Now, now you got some people who who are just, you know, you know, just straight up uh disregarding what the scriptures say, man. Okay. It, it, the scriptures say don't get no safe ups. Niggas gonna go go get safe ups, you know, and, and try to make the scriptures out to say, oh, dang, dang, what the scriptures say. You know, it's talking about something totally different. You know. Whether whether it's talking about you know that or whatever, I don't want to be in a position where I'm a I'm 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 even uh, able to 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 offend in that area, man. Okay, so if a brother say, "Hey, man, no more say pups," oh oh, hey, I ain't getting no more say pups. Now if somebody adding on to the word, then that's totally different, man. Okay, it's um, Romans six and one. What shall we say then? Shall we continue in sin that grace may be abound? Okay? So just because you're in this truth, you know, you, you, you're going to go off. You're going to sin, man. Okay? And we protected by, by grace, but that don't mean that we're going, we, we supposed to continue to sin. Okay? Um, Jumping down to the 12th verse. Let not sin, therefore, reign in your mortal body. Okay? Because it's a fight, man. Okay? It's a fight. 
uh, this the, the sin is not supposed to be, you know, what the scriptures say, wisdom will not dwell in a malicious soul. Okay? Let's see what this word malicious uh, means. Okay? Intending or intended to, to do harm. Okay? You got people that are straight up willing to do harm onto Yahweh some Yahweh because they don't have no fear, man. Okay? They don't they don't care about oh I'm I'm destroying my body. Okay? And that's why that's where the 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 um the the the, the wickedness is coming coming from because people don't have no no regards on to this truth, man. Okay? As before I came into this truth, you know, this is just, you know, a little testimony for myself. You know, of course I wasn't, you know, totally into the truth, you know. But before I came into the truth, you know, I gave up, you know, pork, crab, shrimps, and all that stuff, you know, and I stopped doing certain things, you know, before I knew I was an Israelite and stuff like that. So I came into the truth and I thought I was, you know, pretty cool. Until you start going through that temptation and you start actually experiencing things. Okay, that's when that's when I started realizing like, like, yo, like, I really need a savior, man. You know, because that 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 the law don't really it's not really uh uh it don't make you righteous, man. You know? The subtle one, my you know? You can't say, oh, just because I, you know, I'm 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 uh I'm not doing certain things that I'm completely righteous, man. Because every brother has certain things that they have to go through, man. Okay? You know, every brother got certain things that they go through. You know, in this in this life, on their own personal level, that they gotta go. You know, their their own little obstacle course that they gotta go through, man. Okay, and we can't be looking at that brother on that. You know, that brother obstacle course easy as fuck. You know, meanwhile, mine's hard as fucking up. You know, I, I'm I I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna get through these trials. But that's you know, b before I was going through stuff, that's how I was. You know, I realized you know. We need we need a savior, man. You know, I need to be saved. You know, that's that's part of the reason why Yahweh Shah passed uh, uh, or, or, or with the sacrifice, man. Okay, so that we have something to believe in, man. Something to, to fight for. Something to keep on going, man. Okay, don't so that we don't just totally give up and go into this world, you know, or or, or, or take that RFID chip, you know, that that R of temptation. Okay. It says, "Let not sin therefore reign in your mortal body, that you should, ob should obey it in the lust thereof." Because it's it's a it's a, a battle, man. Okay, so many demons out in this fucking world, man. Okay, and what did what, what what did that scripture say, man? With you know the the, the that demon that 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 ended up leaving and, and he comes back with seven. Seven more demons, you know, stronger than him. You know, uh, you got some people out here that was in his truth, and they end up having more demons on them than they had before, man. But it's supposed to be a fight, man. You know, rebuke them demons. Satan, I rebuke you in the name of y'all by some y'all shot. Okay, you rebuke them demons, man. It says, neither yield ye your members as instruments of unrighteousness unto sin. So don't don't give up. Hey, I know I'm a I'm a just a demon, so I'm gonna just continue to be a demon. Like that uh, <laughs> with that guy uh <laughs> uh in shape with the ape or whatever, the Milwaukee demons. Nigga said, I know I'm a two-third. Like you just gave up. Like what the fuck? You just totally gave up, man. We ain't supposed to be like that. You know? Continue to fight, man. Yeah, he said he, he carnal. <laughs> well, you wanna fight people, man. It says, but yield ye your, yield yourselves unto Yahweh by Simeon Sa is those that are alive from the dead. And and once again, what that scripture said, man, in wisdom of Solomon, man. Okay, that's why precept upon precept is beautiful, man. Okay, I'm going to get that again. 
it says, uh, first set wisdom of Solomon 1 and 13. For God made not death, neither hath he pleasure in the destruction of the living, right? It says, but yield you yourselves unto God as those that are alive from the dead. And your members as instruments of righteousness unto God. For sin so not have dominion over you. For you are not under the law but under grace. What then? Shall we sin? Because we are not under the law. But under grace. God forbid. Okay. So you're not supposed to just give up. Now you got Isaiah uh, 64. And um, 6. Okay. Isaiah 64 and uh, 6. Okay, it says, uh, But we are all as an unclean thing, and all our righteousness are as filthy rugs, rags. And we all do, we all are, are, are worthy of death, man, no, no matter which way you put it. Okay, it says, um, And we do, and we all do fade as a leaf, and our iniquities, like the wind, have taken us away. So ain't no such thing as a man in this truth that's 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 perfect, you know. Now the scriptures say mark the perfect man because that man's gonna realize that he ain't perfect, you know. But he continuing on, and that's the type of guy that you wanna you wanna uh, deal with, man, a humble man, you know. But we know that we ain't we ain't we ain't it ain't our righteousness come from y'all by some y'all side, not our own righteousness, man. Okay. So, um, uh, continuing on, okay, uh, let me get this, Mark, the, uh, second chapter, okay, Mark 2 and, uh, 17, it says, when Yahweh saw, oh, uh, yeah, Mark 2 and 17, when Yahweh saw heard it, he said unto them, They that are whole have no need of a physician, of, of the physician, which the physician is Yahweh saw. It says, But they that are sick, and we are we are all sick. Okay? You supposed to feel like you're sick. You ain't supposed to feel like you whole. Okay? It says, I came not to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. Okay? And um that's one of the reasons which which I'm gonna go into Lord willing, I'm gonna do a video about, you know, what um you know why why Yahawasai uh died. Because, you know, i I think that some people, you know, they don't believe in, in this truth they don't believe that, you know, Yahawasai actually, you know, um died, you know. Or understand why he died. They just some guys are just in this truth and don't have a clue what the fuck they're into, man. Okay, they ain't changed. They ain't take that world off them. You know, you ain't supposed to be like that, man. Okay, but but you know the Lord did away with the um the uh the ancient uh way of uh, uh sacrifice because people would just you know already have their uh their uh you know their lamb ready, man. Okay, and that's how some people in this true far, yeah. You know? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go sin. I'm gonna go do something, you know, because I already know your house is gonna forgive me. The, the scriptures is against that that way of thought, man. Okay, but the scriptures say that the Lord came came to to, to call, uh, uh, not the righteous but sinners to repentance, right? When when uh Yahweh was walking on the water, right, and and Peter, you know, uh, uh came. You know, ask them, can I, can I get on the, um, can I, you know, walk on the water, right? And, and he started walking on the water, right? And then he started falling. And he said, hey, oh Lord, you know, for, you know, I'm, I'm a sinner, man, you know? And, and what, what did, what did Yahweh Shah say? Oh, oh, ye of little faith, man, why did you doubt? Okay? Here you are right here with a man that's walking on water. Okay, and you 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 fall and then you you end up you know saying hey you know I I'm a sinner you 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 showing that you don't believe in him man you know which he ultimately do believe in him 
You know, but the Lord set that example for a reason. Okay? If if Peter, the head disciple, is able to, to admit and say, I'm a I'm a sinner, okay? Then how much more more us, man? Okay? Con. Um, I'm gonna get this scripture, okay? Um, and I'm gonna um end the lesson, okay? This is um the book of uh second Samuel. Yeah, they was they were scared in that uh when the when the uh waters was, was rocking, man. Rocking that boat, man. Okay, uh second Samuel uh chapter twelve and uh fifteen, right? It says um It says, and Nathan departed unto his house, and the Lord struck the child that Uriah's wife bare unto David, and it was very sick. Okay, you know about the story, you know, uh, King David, you know, had sex with uh, Uriah, the Hittite uh, wife. Okay, King David committed adultery, right? And the Lord had, had mercy on him, okay? Now, <laughs> Now, I, I wouldn't suggest you go out there and go go do some sh something like that, man. Okay? Because hey, you, you don't know if the Lord going to have mercy on you. Okay? It says, um... And it was very sick. David therefore besought, besought God for the child. And David fasted and went in and lay all night upon the earth. Right? So, so normally when you, when you do something wrong, right, you, you fast, okay, you pray to your Abbasim Yahweh you know, for, for forgiveness, for mercy, okay, and you don't know what the heck going, going to happen, you know, after, after that point, you, you just did something wrong, you, you asking for forgiveness, you know, because you want, you want, you, you don't want to displease the Lord. Okay, and if you actually sincere, the Lord can have mercy on you, man. Okay, it said this is what happens because you know King David at that time he, he was letting his sins, you know, weigh him down, right? And the elders of the of, of his house arose and went to him to raise him up from the earth, but he would not. Neither did he eat bread with them, so he wasn't, you know, uh, eating, right? It says, and it came to pass on the seventh day. Right, that the child died. And the servants of David feared to tell him that the child was dead. For they said, Behold, while the child was yet alive, we spake unto him, and he would not hearken unto our voice. How will he then vex himself if we tell him that the child is dead? Right? It says, But when David saw that his servants whispered, David perceived. That the child was dead, therefore David said unto his servants, Is the child dead? And he and they said, He is dead. Then David arose from the earth and washed and anointed himself and changed his apparel and came into the house of the Lord and worshipped. Then he came to his own house, and when he required, they set bread before him, and he did eat. Then said his servants unto him, What thing is this that thou hast done? Thou didst fast and weep for the child while it was alive, but when the child was dead, thou didst rise and eat bread. And he said, While the child was yet alive, I fasted and wept. For I said, Who can tell whether God will be gracious to me that the child may live? It says, But now he is dead. Wherefore said I fast? Can I bring him back again? Shall I go to him? But he shall not return to me. Okay? And David comforted Bathsheba, his wife, and went in unto her and lay with her. And she bare a son and called his name Solomon. And the Lord loved him. Okay. So the Lord, you know, is a merciful power, man. Okay. And we know that, you know, King Solomon is, is Yahweh Shah. Okay. So, so the Lord is a merciful power, man. Okay. And when you go into the word mercy, okay. That's beautiful thing to go into words okay it says compassion or forgiveness shown towards someone 
whom it is within one's power to punish or harm. Okay? And the Lord don't want to, you know, you, you living and you doing what he said. Yeah, you're going to go off. The Lord don't want to harm you, man. Okay? He want to have mercy on you. And, and, and we supposed to, you know, have that same mercy and compassion onto other brothers, man. If, they, if they're sincere about this, this truth, man. Okay? You see a nigga doing, doing niggerly, you know, they, hey, <laughs> hey the Lord going to destroy them. Okay? But you see somebody that's in this truth and they actually pushing. Okay, and we pushing, hey, the Lord, we expect the Lord to have mercy on us, man. Okay, even though we even though we need we we all deserve to be destroyed. But we gotta keep on pushing, man. Okay? And stop, you know, don't have them thoughts like, hey man, I could be, you know, destroyed. Yes, yeah, you know, it's good to have that balance, you know, but but the whole time you could have did something wrong. Okay, and you keep on pushing and you find out to find out you you wanted 144,000, man. Okay, because you, you didn't give up. You ain't let them sins weigh you down, man. Okay. So we all we all are, uh, are able to go off, you know, but we got we got to keep on pushing, man. You know, every every last one of us, you know, uh, 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 um, like the scripture say again, man, all of our righteous. All of our righteousness are as filthy rags, you know. So it ain't no guarantee that we we gonna even be able to, uh, you know, live to see what was you know th that salvation, man. You know, we we can end up being destroyed before then. You know, we all d d are deserving of death. You know, but yeah, like you said, you know, finish the course, man. Okay. Finish that course, man. That that obstacle course, man. Finish finish that course, man. No matter how hard you think it may be, okay. Finish it, man. Don't give up. Don't 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 quit in the middle in the middle of the game. Like fuck it, that nigga. Uh, who the fuck his name is, man? Vontae Davis, man. Just gave up in the middle of the fucking game and shit, man. Don't don't be like Vontae Davis. You know, I just I quit. You know. But with that, man, you know, I want to say uh, Salawam.